Go, Emily, welcome in Belgium. Welcome back in Belgium, because this is not the first time you've been here. No, I've been here before. I performed once last year, so very excited to be back, yeah. yes. Any special memories about your uh, performance then? Uh, yeah, I remember the crowd being really quite loud and energetic, so um, I'm hoping we'll get the same tonight. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I love being here. It's such mm -hmm. a beautiful, beautiful city. Loud and full energy, vond het publiek hier vorige keer, dus dat belooft. I I'm, not, I'm not feeling sick or something, that's Dutch. I was <laughs> <laughs> so um, tonight you you are the like the hottest ticket in town and even the hottest ticket of the year I think <laughs> in Brussels. Uh, everything is going really really well for you. Yes, I mean last year was incredible and uh, everything that's happened with the album and now just in you in the rest of Europe as well yeah. just feels amazing. So I'm having a great time. You could sell out a, a, a football stadium I, I think. Why do you why do you like to perform in smaller venues? Um, well, for me, it's just so much more intimate. The music is very soulful and you have to give a lot of yourself. Mm -hmm. So I prefer it when I can see people and I can feel the energy. Yeah. And I just, I think in arenas and bigger places, you can't feel it. It's very cold. Uh -huh. yeah. Ze, ze treedt liever op in kleine zaaltjes, omdat ze dan dichter bij de mensen kan zijn. En de voetbalstadions zijn voor later. What can people expect uh, tonight? Um, well, a lot of energy, um, a lot of um, soul, you know, just yeah. big singing and new songs tonight. So okay. people Ooh. can expect things they, they haven't heard on the album. Um, so I'm excited to, well, I'm a bit nervous, but excited to show people <laughs> what I've got. One of my favorite songs of yours is uh, Beneath You're Beautiful with Labyrinth. But how are you going to do that one tonight? Tonight, well, my uh, backing singer called Aaron, he's oh. going to be Labyrinth for the night. So nice. we're going to try it out. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing a lot of featurings and, and co-ops with other uh, artists. Is there anything special coming up we should know of? Um, well, I'm working with Kendrick Lamar. I'm a big oh, fan of his, yeah. so he, he's done a remix. Me too. Of, uh, <laughs> he's brilliant. Yeah. Of Next to Me, so uh, working with him over in the States, that was really exciting. And yeah. just uh, I'm going to just try when I start writing again to, to do some more, because I oh. love it. We love it. Ze <laughs> gaat samenwerken met Kendrick Lamar, want daar is een grote fan van. Wij ook, hè, bij Eminem. Uh, you got married 171 days ago. Oh, wow. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. How is married life? Um, brilliant. I really love it. Yeah. And um, yeah, it was a fantastic day. I'm glad we managed to fit it in yeah. with everything. But uh, it was wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Did it change anything? Yeah, it changed a lot. I felt very different when I got yeah. married. I felt very stable <laughs> and I felt um, he brought a lot of discipline into my life. Yeah. So that was um, that was great just to have yeah. that partnership. And I think I bring creativity into his yeah. and he kind of make things sure things go a bit straighter. Yeah. He's, a, he's a scientist. He's a marine biologist, yes. I think. But th does he like music too? Does he have musical talent? Yes. Um, I mean, he loves music and yeah. uh, he's not a musician, but he definitely has a big love for, for music. And he can help you picking songs and stuff. Yeah, he can uh, He can help me more with science. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But you're, you're a scientist too. You studied medicine for a couple of years. You stopped yeah. to, to, to make music, to make yeah. music like you're doing now. Do, uh, do you have any plans to finish your... Okay. Medicine school? Um, well, I studied for four years and I got my degree in neuroscience. Yeah. But I would love eventually to go back and finish the full doctorate. Um, yeah. One day. Right now it's like, <laughs> it's on the other side of my head. Too busy. And babies. Babies? Oh, yeah. That's another thing that's like, that's, <laughs> that's very far away. <laughs> First work. Uh, one other important question. My, my hairdresser told me uh, to ask you if you are having any plans to change your haircuts. Did because you know they, they, sh they want to be prepared when all the copycats <laughs> rush in. <laughs> um, no, well, not, not for the next album, maybe. I mean, it's very hard to kind of make sure it stays up. So maybe something yeah. a bit more simple next time. But at yeah. the moment, I'm going to stick with it. And one last thing, uh, Sunday, it's your birthday. Yes, it is. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> will you be home then? Uh, no, we will be in Germany. Oh my God, you're working yeah, on your we'll, birthday. I think the day's off, but we okay. have the day over there. So uh, yeah, I'll be 26. Yeah. I, I wish you the happiest of birthdays Thank and you. lots of fun tonight and when you return on the 16th of April to this yep. same venue. Yes, thank you. I'll be Thank here. you. Break a leg. Thank you very much.